Welcome to another edition of the most consistent, prolific, and dedicated uploads in YouTube history. This is Sean's View Entertainment on YouTube.com. Make sure to like this video and subscribe. With a major update as it concerns The Rock, his future and status with the WWE. There's been a lot of speculation. There's been a lot of rumors whether or not The Rock will ever return. The Rock will have that one more last outing, that ma that last match at a WrestleMania. Now, we know the last two WrestleManias didn't go the way that The Rock wanted them. Because of injury, because of the direction, The Rock got mad at the WWE. The, the Rock was not pleased with the way the WWE wanted to utilize him at, at WrestleMania 29 against John Cena uh, from the MetLife Stadium, but there was just a lot of differences and there was a lot of troubles and there was a lot of things going on and JR who has a lot of insight, a lot of knowledge and a lot of backing to the WWE and the superstars and we know JR's influence on WWE. He was recently asked, do you think The Rock is done or do you think The Rock is going to be returning that one more last time and pretty much what Jim Ross said and the link and the proof is in the description of this video is that with The Rock's competitive spirit and the fact that he wouldn't want, the that he doesn't see The Rock uh, having his last match due to an injury and being a losing effort that The Rock would want to come back under different circumstances and go out there and put on the performance that he would love to put on because in the last two performances at WrestleMania against John Cena, The Rock wasn't up to par. The, Ro the Rock wasn't as good as he would have liked to be because he got injured early on in the match. He got injured two times at two consecutive WrestleManias against John Cena. Now we know The Rock is in great, great condition. We know The Rock is in great shape. But when you're not used to wrestling, when you're not used to taking the bumps, and some say that The Rock changed. Some say that The Rock wasn't what they remember him to be. Well, sure he wasn't. I mean, he's older. He's more mature. Uh, you know, you, you, once you get older, you, you know, and you get the dynamic of PG. So The Rock had to watch where he, what he was going to say. And although creative and, you know, the WWE powers that be tell you, oh, you're going to say this, you're going to say that, and they dictate what, you know, what they spoon, f spoon feed it to you. The Rock went out there and said what he had to say, and he did what he had to do. Now, The Rock brought great numbers. If it weren't for The Rock, WrestleMania, the last couple of them, the last three of them, actually, 27, 28, 29, would have not done as good if it weren't for The Rock. So you have to realize The Rock's trials and his tribulations. you got to understand The Rock's contribution. The Rock came back. He may not have been as good on the mic or in the ring, but The Rock came back because it's in his blood. It's in the business. The Rock loves the WWE. The Rock loves the fans. He loves the electricity. And more importantly, The Rock loves the emotion. Now, like I said, a lot of people are against The Rock. A lot of people are hating on The Rock because, like I said, he wasn't up to par. He wasn't The Rock of old, but you gotta understand this wasn't the attitude era, this wasn't the ruthless aggression era. You gotta understand that it was a different time, it was a different age, it was another era. So, I mean, I think The Rock did the best with what he had to work with. Your comments and your opinions on The Rock's future and status, and do you think, personally, that The Rock will return to the WWE? Subscribe, I'm gonna pick that phone call up, it's Obama.